Live from Cinefax High School, it's The Tonight Show with your host, Pavel Nangfak. On tonight's show, musicians past and present from the Cinefax Music Program, Ottawa professional musicians Jeff Aslin and Jim Bryson, Cinefax EA and singer-songwriter Larry Carroll, Cinefax music teacher and professional musician John Yamensky, Cinefax principal Sean Kelly, featuring the music you hear now performed by the Cinefax music students here and much more. Tonight's guests are going to show you why you should take the music program at St. FX. No matter what grade you're in, you can learn to play a wind instrument, drums or percussion, or guitar. You can get a credit doing something fun and meet new friends for life along the way while you do it. You can go on exciting trips, do cool projects that teach you life skills that you can use no matter what you choose to do in life. This video is an example of one of those projects, but don't take my word for it. Listen to what these students our principal, Mr. Kelly, and professional musicians, including Mr. Yameski, have to say about it. Um, so why did you guys decide to take grade 9 music? Personally, what got me into music was that I always listened to music. And I feel for, for everyone who listens to music, when you're listening to these amazing guitar solos or these groovy bass lines, there's always a thought in the back of your head like, what if I was playing that myself? with my own fingers, with my own hands. And I guess if you just kind of follow that thought like long enough, then you start playing music and it's great. It is a very fun course and uh, you get to play music in it, obviously. I had a real like passion for music when I like first joined and uh, I wanted to get better at electric bass, which, you know, is the instrument I still play today. And uh, I do say that I definitely got better because of this course. When I got there, uh, it was such a great experience. I knew I had to do it again in the following years, and I intend on doing it again later, yeah. Well, I think everybody should take music. <laughs> um, music requires different types of thinking. You know, it's, it's very methodical, right? So it, it's a... It's mathematical as well, if you want to think of it like that. But it's a different style of learning. It, it stimulates different parts of the brain to learn music, which you know helps in any student's progress, regardless if they want to continue playing music or not, right? But it's also really nice. Music is such a, a fun hobby, if anything, right? So it's, it relieves stress. So there's a lot of benefits to studying music and to learning how to play an instrument. Music has changed my life as it changes most people's lives. But also, uh, of course, you know, being able to have a career in music has been, uh, you know, really, really rewarding. And it's been great. And I hope to uh, continue performing as a musician full time uh, when I hang up my uh, teaching certificate. <laughs> In addition to the video project you're watching right now, another innovative and fun project our music students did was recording this performance virtually of the classic soul tune, Knock on Wood. It's like thunder, lightning, the way you love me is frightening, I better knock on wood. Let's get to know the man at the helm of our music program, Mr. Yamansky. Here's a clip of a television performance of his band, The Hurricanes, from before he became a music teacher. You've been learning from Mr. Yamansky for a couple years in this music program. What do you think of him, and do you think he's a good teacher? Have you learned a lot from him? Honestly, great guy. Because, like, <laughs> as well as that he's teaching a course, he's teaching his passion. You know, when he rambles on about something, when he doesn't mean to it's just like you see it right there how much he loves music and it just translates completely throughout the class mr yamensky he's generally really friendly and really uh, motivating about music and like continuing to play it and he's very knowledgeable he'll usually help you out with uh like a composition or like a piece of music if you have some problems with it he'll give you some tips He'll give you some of his advice, which is always great. He has this enthusiasm about class that makes every class interesting and engaging <laughs> and just makes you want to play. Yeah. And there's kids in this uh, program that are still like new to instruments, mm -hmm. or like kids who are picking up a new instrument. I like that he takes it slow for them and he's like, he's, he's very uh, empathetic and passionate. <laughs> oh, we don't like him. 
Not at all. I'm <laughs> kidding. <laughs> No, honestly, I feel like I'm very lucky to have Nas. I very much like Mr. Mensky because yeah. I feel that he's always there when I need some kind of assistance or when I feel like I'm not sure about something and he's always introducing us to new ideas and he's al- he's a great leader. He's always guiding us. I just feel that I'm very lucky to have him as a teacher. Like, I feel very lucky. describe a rewarding feeling uh, while playing uh, any sort of music it's like a, a feeling that is it is it can be aligned to what does a great meal taste like like it's a satisfaction that you get from anything that that is like a is a reward it's it's intrinsic you feel it like through your body and I remember a friend of mine said to me after a show we played he said don't you wish you could just put that in a bottle and you could use it for when you're down how does the music uh, make you feel? Oh, alive. <laughs> it makes me feel magical. It makes me feel complete. The first time I did a concert with a band, we went up on stage and we played, but it was so magical because I had never heard like a band that big all making noise together. And even though we weren't the best in the world, it was still awesome because I could hear all around me these things coming together and harmonizing and it was so nice just to be a part of that you know make something that beautiful like I get a physical sensation from music and like it lifts me and it makes me feel so connected but it's like just hearing it's like it it almost feels like a spiritual experience for me what was your favorite part of the program the friends I really it's such a quick and easy way to make friends Um, I also really enjoyed the adrenaline rush of performing with people and doing those excursions as well. Like, uh, we got to go to Disney in grade nine, we went to Washington, we got to go to Toronto, Quebec. Um, it's, it's a win-win situation. (laughs) You get a grade, you get a credit, and you get to go to cool places and meet cool people. So the Washington band trip is probably one of the favorite trips I've ever taken. And I'd happily take it again any day, because even still two years later now, I can remember staying up till 1am with my friends laughing at the dumbest stuff in a hotel room. I remember running through the Smithsonian's, trying to point out things that I had on my bucket list that I wanted to see. I remember getting pizza in New Jersey. I remember getting pizza in Washington. That trip was great because not only did I get to connect with my current friends, like my already close friends, I got to become close friends with everyone on the band trip. And I'm still in touch with some of the new friends from that trip even today. So that was a great trip. And I think it's an experience only band can really provide. I liked the bus ride there. I liked all the activities that we had planned. I enjoyed watching other people play. And I enjoyed when we played at the seniors home. Those people were amazing and it was great to see them happy. And I also enjoyed just spending time with my friends and going on little adventures all throughout DC uh, and even just Once we were in our rooms at night, I had some of the best moments of my life uh, on that trip. Yeah. And we still talk about it to this day quite regularly. Stuff about DC comes up a lot. So that trip was amazing. I would definitely go on it again. So you mentioned that you did music like as part of your school in the past. Um, How do you think that impacted your life after you got out of school? I took it. Uh, not only as an academic pursuit, but as I moved on from high school, uh, it became part of my hobby. But I I would tell you that individuals that I was involved with within the music program at high school are still the people I'm hanging out with. And it's been a few years since I left high school, but uh, I still see those individuals. We still get together, play music, get together and chat, but uh, they've remained good friends of mine. A great thing that's come out of that interest that I had was that you're working with like-minded people with the same kind of interests as you have and some great friendships develop out of that and friendships that have continued for 20 plus years. So that's been a really nice side effect of my involvement in, in music. Benders are really fun. It helps you a ton at competitions. Gold we've won. Give music a shot. Music, you like it a lot. When it's all done, 
and see your skills and got music exceeds your expectations it's gonna change your generations music is motivation expression and innovation when you hear our creations you'll know we're taking over the nation every city every station here you make lots of friends that you'll have to the end people same as you and me Experiences of planning, 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 memories you'll make men. Come on and express your feelings, get it next to credit, pass your ceilings. It's the immensity in the room, jamming on these guitar tunes. I'm gonna fly, gonna go zoom, bang on the drums, gonna go boom. Saying it back, students, let's turn up the ball, let's turn up the ball. Thanks for watching our show. This video was done in partnership with Youth Ottawa by Mr. Yemensky's grades 10, 11, and 12 and after school music band classes. Done by students for students with only minimal guidance from Mr. Yemensky and Jesse Card from Youth Ottawa. Look forward to, for the soon to be released full length documentary, Innovation and the St. FX Music Program. You'll find it on the school website, upcoming school newsletters, QR codes on flyers around the school on YouTube and anywhere else we can think of. Thank you for watching.